what I tell them, Paul, is the cancer of today is not the cancer of yesterday. No. No. Yeah. It is, um, it's, it's a completely different beast. And I, I, I don't use that word uh, lightly. That's exactly what it is where you, I think you laid that out real well, where a very, e you know, very easily treated cancer goes into remission um, and then it comes back and it responds to absolutely nothing. Right. It doesn't matter what letter or what name hospital mm -hmm. system is trying to treat it. It mm -hmm. responds to yeah. nothing from a 26 year old with stage four breast cancer to yeah. a 44 year old man with co-primary uh, pancreatic cancer and breast cancer. I mean, these are things that you would just go, oh, that's textbook case review to publish because nobody ever, ever sees it. And now it's like, uh, it's every time you turn around. I believe what you're leading as teacher and your experience in healing and as a scientist is you're recognizing how cancer has changed. Mm. And we were talking about this before when we were down in the lobby about how what we have in medicine, heck, what we have around the world is everything so compartmentalized, everything so fractured. And that just doesn't bode well in medicine. And the patient's left in the middle going, hey, what about me? Mm -hmm. 